Hello and welcome. So here I am playing Yakuza 0 once again. I think I'm on chapter 11 or 12. Um, I didn't record last weekend, but I figured today. So this is going up on Sunday. T tomorrow or, or Sunday. Yeah. So I, I uh, you know, I, I work for three weeks. That was a temp job, but this should, there's a good chance to invite me back next month. Um, but I'm probably going to go to a job fair on Thursday. Uh, anyway, um, I was thinking about that. Seems like there's a lot of good opportunities there to find out about. Yeah, what chapter am I on? Chapter 11, okay. And I should probably... Let me get some more uh, health items if I can. Yeah. And so this time off, you know, I've been looking for other work. Um, I think I can get some from here. Some health items? No, this is that. Pawn shop or whatever it is. I think it was somewhere else. But I'm kind of doing my own, I guess, 31 days of horror in a way. Since I've never really done it before, because last year I I was taking classes. I think it was Monday and Wednesday night, so I didn't really watch movies, you know, then when I when I had class. Um, I mean, I'm. I'm not really doing reviews just because I'm not really good at reviewing things. I don't have a lot of experience at reviewing things. And if I were to, you know, up review and upload my reviews to YouTube, that would be a lot of work uh, as well. But I mean, you can do it however you want. I mean, you're not required to review movies you watch. Just I'll spend 20,000 yen on those. All right. Um, I mean, I could be analytical about stuff. Probably more so with writing than with you know when I'm talking. I mean, I, I mean, I think it's about the same, but I tend to do it a lot more when I write than when I talk. Um, what's what's this? Oh, I don't think I've ever been to this restaurant before. Yeah, I'll have some to eat. Why not? I will have uh, soup of the day. Sounds good. I don't know what Keiseki is. My friend from Japan might know. I should ask him. I'll have the soup of the day. That sounds good. Alright. <laughs> so this is actually is part of a sub store, I didn't know that. I don't eat a lot of fast food myself. Be once or twice a week. And that's it. Like, I prefer to eat healthy. Um, I like fruit. I like vegetables, chicken, beef. Um, <laughs> lamb chops. I have to keep that in mind. Build up friendship with these guys. I kind of want to. I, I'm planning on dining with you guys again. Yeah, you guys are good food. But yeah, it's it's interesting how in this game is talking about the guy was talking about his son who eats a lot of fast food, and I I tend not to. I'm gonna go. 
Because I have this weapon pickup I, I wanted to do. And that part, that's part of a sub-story, which I'm kind of in the middle of. Um, so I'm going to show part of that, I think. But anyway, um, 31 Days of Horror. Well, I recently watched a movie called uh, Strange Behavior, which I hadn't seen that in a long time, and I, and I got the DVD about a month ago, and I figured, hey, why not watch it again? So I did. And, uh, and I think I enjoyed it. I think I probably just as much as I, I mean, I really, I like that movie. Um, so I think I enjoyed it just as much as I did the first time. Um, you know, since I had seen it a long time, I was like watching it for the first time because I didn't remember most of the movie, but still, I mean, a different take on a slasher film because it's about this group of people that are performing experiments like kids to make them into killers. Hi. You know, and it, it's not your traditional kind. Walking among credit stores, the buyer is lovely haggled this, haggling with sellers. Credit suddenly appeared after putting a canvas sack on her head. He took the negotiations. With that back, interference from the locals. Success, Smith went reasonably well. Alright. Okay, cool. Sure thing. I'll do that. So, the deal with this is you can train with this guy. I do, do plan on doing training with him. Um, and then this with this lady, you can do an equipment search for weapons. You can buy equipment. You can craft equipment. You can sell equipment. You can repair. I don't know what I have to craft, though. I should find out. I think I'll make a metal bat. I mean, why not? And I don't know if I can craft anything else. But yeah, it's basically you send out agents to um, to get equipment and weapons. Um, it's kind of cool, and, then, and there's, I think it takes about five minutes, which I think is real time, in order for them to get the weapons and parts. Okay. Need for this? Because I, th I don't think I put that. I brought that to the guy in the phone booth. Yeah. That's cutting out. Um, so I don't even remember where that phone booth is. I think it's this one. So I guess I can just take a taxi, that's the quickest way to get over there. But yeah, Strange Behavior is interesting because there's another movie, so Strange Behavior is set, set in Illinois. I just have to fight these guys just to get the taxi. And that was made in 1981, that movie. And then there's another movie in 1983 called uh, Strange Invaders. You know, it's an alien invasion type of movie. And both movies are made by Michael Laughlin. And he was going to do a third movie, which never got made. But it was interesting is there's another movie, I think it's from 97 or 98, called Disturbing Behavior with James Marsden, Katie Holmes, and Nick Stahl. And it's been a while since I've seen that movie, but I, but I enjoyed it. Um, it. It has a similar plot to Strange Behavior because it's about these kids that are made perfect. It may to be perfect, but their hormones kind of uh, cause that to backfire. You know, they're being experimented on as well in that movie. So I guess my, my theory is that, you know, that's kind of an unofficial third part to 
uh, strange behavior and strange invaders because there was, you know, Michael Often didn't make a third movie. You know, it was a David Nutter movie who had made Disturbing Behavior. He was the director of that movie. And what's interesting about Disturbing Behavior is that, um, you can watch a review on Good Flick, Good Bad Flex. Um, I didn't know, but it had a lot of production problems when it was being made. Like, originally it was supposed to be, I think it was about 115 minutes. Um, and that was a test screening, and and apparently it was, you know, the studios didn't like all the, you know, exposition went on. So they had it cut down to, I think it was about 84 minutes. And I think the DVD off eventually, the seen that one again. Um... It does have some of the deleted scenes that were cut from the, uh, you know, 114 or however minutes it was, uh, you know, vi the, the longer version. But, yeah. It was still a good movie, though. It's just sad that that had to happen to it because I don't think that the, uh, you know, the director's preferred version will ever come out. Trying this broadsword. Oh. I don't think I have one of those. Not yet. Um. Okay. It's a bit of a, a gamble to get some of this stuff. But I don't think I have one yet. So I'm gonna have to try that again later. But basically, um... There's this guy, and I first gave him a, that 9mm nine nine automatic pistol, which, you know, you, you may have seen here. I could go back over there, I guess, and, and see if... I mean, I'll just take a taxi again, there might be... Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna have to spend money, but whatever. Um... I w I'm gonna check to see if I- if I have that. Cause I don't know if I do. And I don't really want to fight this guy right now. Okay, I can avoid it by going in here. Yeah, I don't know if I have that. Uh, buy equipment? And I don't think I have it yet. So I guess it can take a while for some of this stuff. Chinese broadsword. Yeah, I don't see it. I could buy that, but I don't really need it. I guess I'll do a search. Why not? Um, I kind of want to show this off anyway because uh, what I do is I look at obtainable types. And that way you can kind of gauge the likelihood of what you're going to get. I mean, you probably just have to go to China to get, you know, East Asia. I don't know which one I did before, but I didn't get the broadsword. I guess I'll go with this guy again. I don't know if I did... I did the political activist last time. So I think I'll try a different agent. Yeah. And you can only send out one agent at a time, which, you know, it makes sense. You know, I mean, even if, even if I don't really like it, you know. I mean, I gotta get into more fights so I can get some more money. <laughs> I feel like I just spend it left or right in this game sometimes, and... I mean, you do have to, you do have to do that in order to upgrade your abilities. 
and you know you do get uh, money from the uh, the restaurant management in this game. I'll have to show that off at some point because it's uh, you know, it's basically a mini game. It it keeps you on your toes. It it, it uh, I should fight these guys for some money. Oh shit! I don't want to fight him. I I don't think I'm ready to fight him yet, but I I plan on it at some point. And I'll fight these guys. They're probably not gonna have a lot, but it'll keep me busy while I'm waiting anyway. But I do think these um, you know, special attacks increase your earnings. So I try to pull them off as much as I can. That's cool. I got all of them at once. I want some money from that. Okay. I could, I guess I could, well, I didn't want to do this after. Because I think that's going to be like the main thing in this video is a part of the mission. Who's this? Hiding man. Why are you hiding? Okay. I guess I'll do that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's not what I expected. Uh, why would somebody steal his pants? I don't know. Doesn't that go for Majima too? Do I have to fight this guy? I guess so. Okay. Pantsless man. Oh, that was too way too easy. <laughs> Didn't take much. Like, if you want to I mean, buy you a pair of pants, you know, and we'll just get money, you know, uh, you know, <laughs> I'll do that. Oh. Bonton Hunter. Uh, I've never heard of those.
Да. So it sounds like he's a thief, this Bonton guy. I think Ma Mag Magutako. I'll do it. I'll do it. Magu or Magutako. I wonder where that is. I've I've never heard of that place. Because I figure this is an easy uh, sub story to get over with. I wonder if that's it right there. I kind of want to look it up because I don't know where that is. Um, on my phone here. I think he's over there. So it looks like. Um, so is Mago talk of the name of the. Yeah, so I had. I was right, but I just checked on my phone. I don't really feel like fighting these guys right now. Okay, whatever. I don't know. It must be here. I've heard of panty rating, but a guy who still sleeps his pants, I don't know, it's kind of, uh, I mean, it's one thing to go commando, but it's quite another to not have pants to wear because they're stolen, you know? <laughs> this guy shouldn't be that hard to fight, though. Is 
what you get for stealing pants, punk. Why do you... I mean, I, I never... I guess I'll never understand why they decided to include this in the game. I guess it's just, you know, Japanese weirdness. Um... I mean, I wonder where he's... Are the pants in his backpack? I... I just wonder. I'm gonna... Hmm... I'm gonna change this. I'm gonna use a gun, I guess. Do I have a shotgun? I don't know. Ah. I'm missing him. This up stuns him for a bit. This hair color I should think it's some kind of uh, you know like a super saiyan or something like that <laughs> I mean maybe he is I don't know but oh, shot. Get one of these. My heat up too. He's just kind of... Not that difficult of a fight. I wish I could get a heat move in there, but I don't think that's gonna happen. You brought it upon yourself. You're the chump, man. Riju or Raiju Raiju Kun? Raiju Raiju I guess it's Say his name. Whatever, dude. Hi. Oh, interesting.
Oh. Yeah, I probably don't like him either. Hi. have to fight his dad. What does fighting have to do with being smart, though? Well, that's because you are a punk. Uh, uh. Kind of apathetic. Uh, sure, I'll do that. I don't know why that's funny though, but okay. I'm gonna check on my. Head back over there. Okay, what'd you get? Hi. I'm kind of the vice lobby hanging this thing. I could have said before. And I've gotten too inquisitive. Okay, I don't know if I got the broadsword yet. Double Chinese broadswords, I don't know. But I'm gonna. I guess I'll buy them and, and see. I mean, if not, I'll have to do it later, but. Because I don't think. Inventory is full. Okay. So I need to get, I need to get rid of something. Or I guess. I guess I'm probably not going to use this dagger. Yeah. And if this uh, doesn't work, I don't know if these count. I mean... But hey, at least I'm trying. I'm gonna quit. Yeah, I'll come back 
But I don't feel like doing another equipment search right now. Um, I feel like it's going to take a little while to get that broadsword. If it's just the single one that is the one that's needed and not the double. Because even those took a little while to get. So. Which is fine. I'm not in a hurry. You know, but I, that is one sub story I'd like to complete. It, 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 it piqued my interest, and that's why I want to do it. That's how I fight these guys. Okay. I've never heard of Bond Sand, but I'll have to look that up. Uh, I'm guessing it has to do with school uniforms, though. Come on. And that was surreal, the, um... I think it was Tuesday, there was a, there was a fire up in the mountains. Um, that happened. Um, it didn't affect my house. It didn't affect my area, but there was a there was a fire, and I'm not saying like I want there to be fires, but it was just surreal because it kind of trippy because of the, the way you know the atmosphere was. The way everything looked like when there is a fire, it's just nothing like it, you know. And and I'm like I said, I don't like there being fires. I mean, I hope everyone who was affected by it is okay. But I was just thinking about that today, that it was, uh... It was pretty trippy, pretty surreal. You know? Because you don't really see fires... Uh, too often. You know? Or, or find out about them too often. I think that was in the Napa area. I believe so. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, have fun with that. Good. So I have to continue this. Yeah, I might as well finish it. I mean, it is kind of a pain in the butt that I have to keep going back and forth, but. I had to fight these guys again. I was trying to throw money uh, so they wouldn't bother me, but oh well. What, what can you do in a game like this? Um, yeah. This might even be a longer recording than usual, I don't know. Maybe over an hour. Usually I try to keep it under an hour, but because of this, sub story is a bit lengthy. You know, more so than I was expecting. Um, and I have the other part I wanted to record as well. And I'll probably just edit two videos together. Means I'm gonna have to render this probably tomorrow. I don't know, if not sooner. But probably tomorrow because... Um, I feel like I'd have the, I'd have the most time to do it tomorrow. You know, I mean I could... I'm gonna end up doing two, you know, two videos together because the PS4 recording on PS4 can uh, last up 
Lasts for up to an hour. And I was able to, to um, adjust that setting so that I could record for up to an hour. I'm not ready to fight that guy yet, like I said, but I do want to at some point. I at least want to give it another shot, because I think I tried once and I didn't quite get it. Okay. Do I have to fight this guy again? I don't really want to. Oh. Well, that's just great. But I feel like if I fought him again, it didn't really solve anything. Okay, well, yeah. I, good. I don't feel like fighting him again anyway. I mean, I, I just feel like fighting him wasn't, uh... Was kind of a waste of time. Because it didn't seem to... Um, I guess produce the de desired results. I'm gonna go back. I guess I'll go back to south, whatever it is, and then I'll. Yeah, I just realized I could take the taxi. That is the quickest way to do it, and even if it's not the right item. I mean, at least I'm trying, because, like I said, I think this is one of the longer, uh, sub-stories in the game, this, uh, phone booth one. I mean, it's kind of, kind of unique, though, because I guess I can't, I'll save, though, I mean, might as well, and I'll go and do that other mission. Okay. And I, I have a feeling that I think I'm pretty close to getting that, but I'll have to try again later. Because I feel like I've already put so much time into that that I don't really want to bother uh, with it right now. You know, it, it, like I said, it is one that I really want to um, finish because it's intriguing. And the whole phone booth aspect it makes me think of that movie phone booth. I like that movie. It was, it was, you know, it's pretty good. I think it was Colin Farrell. It was in that movie. I'll fight these guys. I guess. I mean, might as well. Oh, that was awesome. Bone cells, so uh, I. Th yeah, I'm good to go, I think. So Nishitani is who I have to talk to or whatever. And then. I don't think there'll be any fighting here. I mean, even if there is, I think I should have enough health items. So I'm not really worried about it. Oh, that's funny. Is he handcuffed too? Uh, I guess he has to be though. 
<laughs> I wasn't expecting this, but okay. Oh, so he's trying to make it look like he is in trouble. I get it. That's what I kind of thought. Like, Majima didn't do anything to, to uh, get, end up in jail. Have fun. <laughs> I don't think jail or prison would be fun. Unless I have to fight him in the cell, that would be interesting. No, no, that would be, uh... Let's hope so. Okay. At least I get to rest, I mean. Oh, is he dead? Or is he knocked out? Wow, oh, this is kind of unexpected. I <laughs> <laughs> don't. No, I'm just visiting. <laughs> ちょうど足も <laughs> That's a good point. I never thought of that one. <laughs> もう一度殴るよって楽しみたいや。ああ、マコトが揃われた。ああ、マコト。やっ、that's Oh, smoking a cigarette because I guess he doesn't have a choice. I mean, it's free, so I mean, I guess he can't say no. Alright. <laughs> なんやて。せやけど、予想はつく。わしでもまじまくんでもない。第三の勢力や。第三の勢力一体何者や。まあ、わしは大型、目星ついとるけどな。知っとるんか誰なんや。あの西谷さん。これ。What is 
Okay, I don't, I don't know in what kind of, you know, prison or, or jail, I guess this is more of a, I could, well, it's a holding cell, where you'd be able to have you know, the, the cop by you bear. <laughs> but okay, you know, I guess it's different in Japan. At least I don't have to fight these guys. I mean, as far as I know, I don't have to. So. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if I'd want to sleep on the floor like that, though. It doesn't seem very comfortable. おしえてあげようかな。けど、どないしようかな。おとなしく安全な寝具らで大怪我することになんで。楽しみや。あしゃ強いもんを見るとな。あそこが固まってしまうわや。もう我慢できへん。さかどうやって<笑><笑> Get up off the floor. Or you'd rather, you'd rather cower in pain, Nishitani. I, I think I've well, because I had a teacher mate, I think, I believe it was in high school. There you go, he went by Mr. Nish. But I think his full last name was Nishiguchi or something like that. See, so he was an, he was an Asian guy. Ooh. That's exciting, I took his weapon. Uh, kind of a quick, quick time event, but it's not... Well, I mean, I don't mind the fact that there's quick time events in this game, because... There's not that many, it doesn't over-rely on them. And that's the problem with I have a quick time events is that they have their purpose, but I feel like they can, you know, games can rely them on to rely on them too much. So they're kind of a lazy uh, design choice. I feel if if they're overutilized. This isn't that hard of a fight, actually. I should get some more, uh... Stamina here. Or stamina in. I always like stamina, though. It's, you know, pretty similar. I'm gonna give you stamina. I just didn't know it was stamina, and I never really read the name of it. I don't think, but it, you know. It, but I think it's like stamina. It's a similar spelling to it. All 
All right. Well, that wasn't too bad of a fight. さすがや。もしもしマジマ君に惚れてもうた。あんた。ほんまにおもろいやつやね。<笑> That's a good question. I never really thought about that. I mean, that might actually maybe it wouldn't hurt to work with him I don't know I mean it's worth considering I think Nikyo consortium 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 おもてむきには登場会の大門を掲げとらん裏の組織やマコトちゃんをさらったのはおそらく日教の総裁セラマサルや誠実前にセラが日教の引き連れてこっちに潜り込んだ中情報が入ってなもし かぶせるのは。二つ。俺に誠を殺すように命令出したのは島の親父。島の中東。登場会の島の。なあ。セラも島の登場。ほんなら登場会ついでや。わしも教えたる。<笑> <島の。笑> わしの雇い主は道島組の渋沢中若頭補佐やどうしま組ドジーマインテレスティングこれまた登場会の直球やセラの日教お前に命令下した島の組ほんで道島組三つ全部登場会や一体どういうこと なんでやろうな。ま、登場会の内輪もめなんかわしには関係あらへんことやけどな。日教連が隠れてる場所は分かっとんのか。ちゃんと調べ上げとるで。Good for you。知ってどないするき。まこと取り返しに決まっとるよ。無理。あ? マジマ君が強いわよ、わかった。じゃあ、一人でどないかなることはあまないで、日記よりは。いいやと。登場会の大門掲げては出来へん。汚い仕事をこなしとる特殊部隊や。さながらアメリカの CIAそれに。I see. That's probably a good idea to team up with him, even though he is kind of... Uh, uh, you know. So the recording just cut off, so I am... I continue recording here. I didn't... You didn't really miss much, though. I don't really like Saga Sagawa that much. How do you say his name? I mean, Nish, Nish, the Snish guy. I'll call him Nish. Um, 
I, uh, he's not very trustworthy either, but I don't think he's gonna shoot Majima. Or do whatever, you know, beat him up or whatever, yeah. ちょっと残りもんにはさせ。残念やな。お前みたいな男と。もっと早く電話かったが。ほんまに残念や。何や急に。何やろな。わしみたいな人間が何を抜かしとんやろ。熱狂連が潜んどる。<笑> つばきえんの中や。オッケー、ワーキープダンマインズ。つばきえん。マイヤ。こっち住んどって I guess this is where I have to go next. ドヨテン。ガイドブックに載っとるようなとこちゃうで。100分は一見に近づや。案内したら。ついでに一緒に暴れたる。天か。俺は死んでもお前に誠は渡さへんぞ。そんな話や。日記俺から誠ちゃん
思いっきり暴れたらえ思いっきり楽しんだらえヤクザなんぞどうせ早よ死ぬんやなら後先考えんと自分の道前に進め Okay, that's probably good advice. Yeah. I think he's dead now. He's about to die. But he just ran out of ammo, so yeah. Okay, see you later. Maybe. Chapter completed. All right. Yeah. I think I'm going to end this recording here. Um, you guys don't have to watch me sh save. I, uh, I mean, might as well end it here, but, um, Thanks for watching, um, and I'll probably be recording again in a, in a week or two, somewhere around there, but thanks for watching, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe.